So, race five, the LFH Juvenile Handicap Hurdle. Over two miles for the four-year-olds. Number one, early worm for Craig Beckwith. Two, the favourite Turian Sunshine for James Shea. Montepanasi Red Bull for Martin Liam is three. Coastal Passage for Craig Beckwith is four. A Conatum like for Pontypool Racing is five. Etoile de Lyon for Vinnie Gerard is six. Destiny Rue for Pontypool is seven. Thunderous Mood for Paul Rhodes is eight. Fantastic Tango for Paul O'Neill is nine. Social Butterfly for Thomas Rogers is ten. Aggressive for Kevin Meenham is eleven. Umiyadi Verdict for Thomas Rogers is twelve. And Bullseye for James Shea makes up third. To go over two miles here. These four year olds, the star has gone away in the racing. Wait for it to settle down and get to the first hurdle. It's aggressive and leads us over it aggressively. Takes up the lead. Early one in second. This is all being held up at the moment. It's aggressive. That's going to lead this from early one. Second, Etoile de Leon up against the fence on the outside of that is Destiny, Ruby, and a Con. Con I still can't say that one. A Continuum like on the outside of that is pushing through well now is Thunderous Mood. And they're a length or so away from the rest that's just being led by Bullseye. And Coastal Passage. And Social Butterfly as they finally get to the second of the eight hurdles. They're all over it. The jump there by Montepanasi Redwood. Purple silks, but we're still going to be led by Aggressor as they go through the first half mile. It's Aggressor from Early Worm, Thunderous Mood, Etoile de Leon, Continuum Like, and Destiny Ruby as they go to the third. And it takes that well, but it's back on landing by Coastal Passage at the rear. That's a reasonable pace being set by Aggressor here from Early Worm, these four year olds. About three back to Thunderous Mood, Etoile de Leon up against the fence. On that and like and Destiny Ruby. Now, a length away from Montepanasi Ribble up against the fence, which really in some ways one of the favourites on the outside. Oh, we've lost two there Coastal Passion and Bullsign. I think they were both brought down. Bad mistake, and they're both out of it. Unlucky. Towards the rear. They're gone. As we come down to halfway, and a mile to go, it's the rest that still leads us from early where the Trois de Leon and Thunderous Mood. Connaught and Like. Nasty Redwood and Turian Sunrise. Fantastic Tango being pushed through. Destiny Ruby didn't get over the last very well. Drop well back. And the Yardy Bird is big over the fifth. Poor jump there this time by Thunderous Moon as he shuffles back. But it's still aggressor. Kevin Meanhan that leads us from Early Worm. Craig Beckwith. These two lead by about four to Etoile de Leon and Vinnie Gerard on the outside of his thunderous mood for Paul Rhodes is making a, a challenge for the for the leaders. And we've got a con Connaughton like to Rean Sunrise. We'll get over that to his aggressor. Just half a length lead now to early one. The thunderous mood is now into third. Etoile de Leon's fourth behind that is a Connaughton like, but it's still aggressor as they come down to the final half mile. They're going to swing right handed and head their way back to the judge, and it's aggressor from early one. Thunderous mood, Etoile de Leon. Montepanasi Red Bull making up a bit of ground now. Out wide is Destiny Ruby, but it's still aggressor. They've got to catch his aggressor. We've taken this race. He goes over the penultimate a little bit slow. The one that jumped it better was Thunderous Mood, who moves up into second now, so it's Aggressor being chased down by Thunderous Mood, Etoile de Leon running well, Montepanasi Redwood still making gains, on the outside of that is Oponaton Wright, but it's Aggressor now being enjoyed by Thunderous Mood, as we come inside the final two, it's Aggressor and Thunderous Mood, Montepanasi Redwood still running on well, so it's Thunderous Mood that just knows he's in front of Aggressor now, the long time leader starts to give way, Montepanasi Redwood's trying to make a change, coming back on the inside is Aggressor again, as Thunderous Mood just starts to slow down, they go over the last and it's Aggressor that leads, just by half Length for Montepanasi Rebel on the outside running on really well now. It's fantastic tango from nowhere, and it's aggressor gives way to Montepanasi Redwood. It gives way to fantastic tango that takes it on the line from Montepanasi Redwood and aggressor. Great finish there by Paul O'Neill's fantastic tango. It came from nowhere, and picked them all on the post just by her neck. So a good win there for fantastic tango. Unlucky to aggressor, our long time leader in second. Onto Panasi Ripper of Martin Leader got up for third. Fourth was Thunderous Mood for Paul Rhodes. Fifth was Umiyadi Verdict. And let's just see the bottom. Let's see if those uh, couple of horses were brought down. They were. Bulls Owls brought down and Coastal Passage. Unlucky to them too.